Hi everyone, Chris here, and today I wanted to talk about backgrounds. And this is specifically a media making sort of tip session, and so I wanted to talk about sometimes you got to pay attention to more than just your content, such as bad backlighting and other crazy noise. But before I share my tips for dealing with that kind of stuff, I wanted to take a moment and share on this oppressively, dangerously hot day. At least it's a dangerous hot wave, heat wave in Portland, Maine. This is Willis Carrier. And he, my friends, is the inventor of the air conditioner. Which leads us to our first background tip, and that is, even on the hot days, chances are you're gonna have to turn off the air conditioner. And the second fun little tip is to pick up one of these guys. This is a Movo lav mic that I picked up in 2015 and it's super simple it's just a tiny little lav mic so this plugs into the laptop and it plugs into my phone which is great so let's uh, let's see what the difference this little guy can make Ooh, can you hear that uh, that fan sound this horrible sound here All right, let's see what it's like when we plug the mic in all right, so this is with the lav mic on. Now this was a $15 mic I picked up in 2015, and I picked it up because it is so small. I literally have this in my laptop bag constantly. That's just where it lives, so I always have it. Um, they also have a lav mic that um, has a plug you can plug in and monitor yourself, and it has a plug if you want to mic up a second person. But for most of the time, if you're going to do a quick instructional video, you're only going to be recording yourself if you're narrating something. And uh, yeah, that little thing, being able to do that anywhere, is really fantastic. And then on mobile, um, either on the iPad or the iPhone, I like to use an app called Movie Pro. And one of the things I like about that is, one, you can use the lab mic, and two, you can use Bluetooth. So I, that's why you see my little Bluetooth headphones in while I'm doing that. I'm also super excited, and I don't know if anybody else is, um, rumor has it that the new Bose Quiet Comforts that are coming out, actually I don't know if they're still called Quiet Comforts, um, are supposed to be able to like go into the coffee shop and record audio and lose all the background noise. So there's hope that with the right kind of tool you'll be able to still have the air conditioner on. Anyway, so those are my tips. Watch background noise and watch your lighting. You don't want to be backlit. You don't want to have weird stuff in the background. Um, that's why I usually do mine in front of the blackboard because it's a neutral. Well, it's not really neutral. It's dark, but it's a it's a background that um, is very non-reflective, so you don't get glare. Um, and I will usually only have professional stuff up there for work stuff, so you're not going to see anything inappropriate. Well, I'm a pretty boring guy. You'd never see anything inappropriate anyway. Um, yeah, so watch your backgrounds and visual and audio backgrounds. So that's my instructional design tip for the day, and I will see you tomorrow.